Hi guys, what are we gonna do today? We're gonna make this cute little board and you could put a hanger on the back, hang a towel on it, whatever you would like, your dog leashes, whatever you can think of. But all we're using is just a simple piece of wood. We put a knob on the top and let's get started so you can see what I do. I'm using a piece of wood and this just happens to be a wood tag. It's kind of nice to work with and it had a hole in the top where you could hang it. This is where I'm gonna put a wooden knob and it's gonna be fun because you can hang things from it. So I'm gonna start decorating this. All I did was coat it with some off-white paint and you can use any color you want. So after that's dried, I just make sure, I just do a light, light sand. And I just, just to make it feel very, very smooth. And that's all I've done with this. I've decided I'm gonna use some transfers and do something that's really fun and springy. So I thought I would use these roses. I am just gonna cut this out. Now you could use a really fun decoupage paper. You could actually just stencil a fun image on here. This is just what I'm going to use today. So these are transfers. I carry these, these are IOD transfers, but you can find transfers online. And like I said, you could just use some pretty decoupage paper or some beautiful napkins with floral prints or something if you wanna do something for spring and just decoupage it on. So when I carefully lift up, I can see if there's anything that didn't stick and I can lay it back down. But it looks like it all went on well. And I am just gonna lightly burnish it down so I know it's adhered really, really well. And then I'm going to line up my bottom piece to this. Cutting some more fun little pieces that I'm gonna add to this. This particular transfer um, is on four pages, so you can piece it together, cut it apart, so I know this goes to this. But it's fun with transfers that you can cut them apart and add, like I could add an extra leaf here if I wanted to, or anything. That's what's really fun with these. So I am gonna put this as far over as I can get it. So this is from another transfer I have, and I just wanted to add some other fun words that matched. So I thought specimen blends would be cute. I usually staple my excess pieces together, so I wanna make sure I take the staple off before I rub, so I don't hurt any of my transfer. Went over the end, I'm just gonna push it down. So I think to add just a little more dimension, I am gonna use my crackle stamp and just do a little hit and miss on this board just to get a little bit more dimension on here. And I'm using a gray ink so it's not so dark, it's just subtle enough that you see it, but it's not taking away from the floral images. Add a little bit to the top of my knob. So we're gonna put our knob on and then we're gonna wax this. I'm gonna use some clear wax over this to start. Then I'm gonna add just a little bit of dark wax. And there you go. So I hope you thought this was a really simple project, whether you use transfers, you use stencil, or you use decoupage. Just taking any piece of wood you have, add a knob, you can hang it on a wall to hang anything you need, and it looks so decorative for the season. Thanks for watching.